another lesson with me. Um, today I'm going to explain the difference between c'è e ci sono. So that means there is and there are. So c'è is used with the singular nouns, for example, c'è una penna sul tavolo, while the plural is the plural form, so ci sono, is used with plural nouns, for example, ci sono due penne sul tavolo. To understand, the speaker who uses these expressions wants to present something or indicate the position of an object, for example. So, c'è una persona in casa, there is a person in the house, ci sono due mele in frigo, there are two apples in the fridge. But, in Italian, uh, you say, c'è molta gente nel negozio. In English, you would say, there are many people in the shop. In Italian, gente that means people is um, singular, while in, while in English it is plural. So that's a, a quite important difference that you, have to, that you have to keep in mind. Now I have an exercise for you. You have to fill in the gaps and you can write your answers in the comment section below. Uno, un telefono nella mia borsa. Due, Poca gente al cinema. 3. I tuoi vestiti in bagno. 4. Molti fiori in balcone. Ok, now fill in the gaps using c'è e ci sono. This grammar topic is simple, I think. So let me know what you think about it in the comment section below. And I'll talk to you in my next video lesson. Have a nice day, buona giornata, ciao!